Hey yo, what's going on guys? It's your boy Kate and welcome back to another video. Hopefully you are all having a super duper epic day today. If you're not, I think I can make it better for you because earlier today I was talking to my man Big Bird and he actually wanted to help you all out a little. Basically, Big Bird came up with this deal where everyone who likes this video gets a free gaming PC. This ain't just no ordinary gaming PC for like Club Penguin. You can render a full Pixar movie on this computer in two seconds. Like it's a beast of a computer. So to get your very own insane gaming computer just like the video and big bird will fly over to your house and give you one for free but anywho earlier today i was scrolling through this video sharing website when i found this video titled how i got my sister pregnant my teen pregnancy animated story time and to be honest my brain immediately just shut down and it has taken a total of five days to start back up because this video is just so terrible so yeah if you're wondering where i've been for the past five days my brain was just processing the title of this video but yeah guys grab your sister grab your mom and grab your toaster because today we are uh, I'm, I'm not even gonna say it J just disintegrate me hi i'm aaron and i'll be telling you my big secret of how i got my sister pregnant what? This seriously can't be real. Like, I refuse to believe that this is actually a topic of a story time. He just says it so casually, too. Like, this story is about the time I got my sister pregnant. Smash like if this has ever happened to you. <laughs> Jesus, dude. I swear to God, every video I find, I'm like positive that it's the worst video on YouTube. Then I just keep on finding worse and worse videos. Like, this has to be the bottom line. Like, all the other videos that I've reacted to that I thought were bad. Like, nah, this one has to be the worst. Like, this one takes the cake 1000%. Story times of how someone got their sister pregnant. Like, I seriously don't know what could possibly be lower than this. Telling this story is very difficult for me, since I've never told any of my friends or family. I mean, that's a good choice not to tell anyone, I'd suppose. Like, imagine if this dude walked up to his mom one day and was just like, Yo, I'm mom. I got some chick pregnant. And if that wasn't bad enough for the mom, when the mom asks who the girl was that he got pregnant, he'd be like, Oh, it's your daughter. Yeah, mom. I got my sister pregnant. Like, what would you do if you were the parent in this situation? Your kid just walked up to you and told you that he got his sister, your daughter, pregnant. Like, what? Just a couple months back, my mom got married to her now husband, Richard. I'm the only child of my mother, and Richard has one daughter, whose name is Natalie. I was 19, and Natalie, my now sister, was 18. My first impression of her was that she's pretty cool and was always very nice to me. Shortly after, our parents sent us to college, which was out of state. What do you mean, our parents sent us to college? Is college like some vacation or daycare or something? Like when parents don't want their kids anymore, they just send them off to an out of state college when they have no clue whatsoever what they want to study or do with their life. Like just throw them in college with no money whatsoever. Like I've never heard of parents sending their kids to college. It's usually your choice as an adult if you want to go to college or what you want to do with your life. Like by the time, you go to college, you're an adult, your parents don't like sign you up for college and drop you off there. We were renting an apartment not too far from campus and everything seemed to be going pretty good. One day when I got home from class, I realized that Natalie was crying, so I went in her room and asked her what was wrong. She told me that her boyfriend broke up with her because she moved out of state to study. I already know that this story is gonna take a dark turn because in the beginning of the video, this dude told us he got his sister pregnant. So like, I'm already really uncomfortable where this is going. Like, I know what's coming up. Like some crazy incest is about to happen or something. And like, ugh, I don't know, man. It's just really, really gross. She seemed devastated and I tried my best to comfort her. We spoke about it and stuff, and we started having a couple of alcoholic drinks. Who in the world says alcoholic drinks? That is not what anyone calls alcohol. Like, this dude goes out to party with the boys, and he's just like, Ahem, excuse me, ladies and gentlemen, may I ask you where the alcoholic drinks are at? I would like an alcoholic drink to consume. Like, no one says that. You just say alcohol 
or wine or beer or booze. Like this dude is the type of guy to call a DS a uh, Nintendo DS Lite handhold gaming system. Like no, you don't even deserve to breathe. By this time, we were watching a movie called Cruel Intentions, which was about a guy who took this girl's virginity. I really did not feel any way strange until she stared at me in the eyes with a smile in a kind of sexual way. Ugh. These two are literally siblings. They are brother and sister. This is so gross. Why is this dude's sister looking at him like that? Why is he into it? Why is this video on YouTube? Why am I still alive? Hmm, strange, I thought, but I continued watching the movie. Way into the movie, she moved closer to me and laid her head on my arm and her hand on my belly and rubbed it slowly. <sighs> stop. Just stop. No. This isn't okay. This is not okay. You can't sleep with your siblings. You guys are literally adults, like 18 and 19 years old. You should know very well that incest is not okay okay i hate this i seriously seriously hate this like so much everything about this video is just so uh but i still did not think anything of it at the end of the movie i left and went in the kitchen to get something for us to eat while she went and took a shower when i went back into her room she was wearing a short spaghetti strap top without a bra i won't lie this did catch my attention dude listen this is your sister i don't care what she's wearing you are seriously messed up in the head if you can look at your sister and feel attracted to her like this needs to end now we need to undo your whole entire life and just erase you from existence humankind is just done for like there's no hope whatsoever for humanity but we sat there and spoke a little while speaking i realized that she was giving me that look again the smile and stare continued, and eventually she moved slowly towards me, and she actually kissed me. No, 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 no. Enough. This is enough. You cannot make out with your brother, or your sister, or any of your siblings. This is not okay whatsoever. This is so freaking gross. Like, there's actually people out there making out with their siblings in 2019. Like, this is current stuff. This is happening on Earth right now. Like I said, humanity is about to get Thanos snapped. I was confused and shocked. She turned to me and confessed her love for me. I could not believe it. I thought this was a dream or something. She said that she always had a crush on me and never felt like I was her brother. I just felt like it was the right time to tell you now that her parents are not close by and since my boyfriend broke up with me. She also said that she knew it might be weird for me, but we don't have to tell anyone. Please don't tell mom that I'm in love with you, because like, I don't want mom knowing that I want to hook up with my brother. Like, I seriously still refuse to believe this is real. Even if it's just some BS story this weird channel made up, I refuse to believe that someone would actually sit down and write this story. Like, come on. That night, we did make love to each other, and it felt great. Bro, why? I don't even know what to say. Uh... I kind of just want to vanish away and like undo me watching this video. Like this guy is telling us how great it was to sleep with his sister. Like no man, just nah. The next morning, I could not believe what had actually happened. I felt a bit disgusted. Yeah, you should feel disgusted, you absolute freak. Like, you literally just slept with your sister. That is quite disgusting. As the days went by, we did it again and again, and most times, we didn't use any protection. So you felt disgusted from sleeping with your sister. However, you continued to do it, and of course, someone who is so brain dead to sleep with their sister also wouldn't use protection while doing so. Like, I seriously can't fathom this video. I am at such a loss for words. Six Six weeks later, she told me that she was pregnant and begged me not to tell her parents. Bro, come on. Listen to yourself. You got your sister. Your freaking sister. Like, your relative, your sibling. You got your sister pregnant, dude. You're so messed up in the head. Like, both of you are so freaking messed up. Like, people often make fun of hillbillies for sleeping with their cousins. Like, whether they do that or not, I don't know. But you took that to a whole other level. Like, it's already not okay whatsoever to sleep with your cousin. And you literally just slept with your sister. And not only did you sleep with your sister, 
sister, you also got her pregnant. Like, holy crap, dude, that's just so freaking foul. I told her that we should have an abortion. Eventually, she agreed, and we aborted the pregnancy. While I can't bear the guilt that I feel from being in a relationship with my sister, even though we're not blood-related. Blood-related or not, it's your sister. That's one of your parents' or step-parents' children. Like, it's not okay, dude. I also feel so guilty for aborting our child. It's been several months now, and we're still together. And he's still dating his sister. He is literally dating his sister. That is a thing. He is in a serious relationship with his sister. I can't make this stuff up, dude. I've grown to love her, but we both don't know what the future holds for us. Hopefully nothing. But yeah, guys, that was quite honestly one of the worst videos I've watched on YouTube. This story has me at just a loss of words. I don't understand why even an animated character would sit there on YouTube and tell the world how he got his sister pregnant. Like, this is just so absurd. Absurd. But yeah guys, hopefully you all aren't scarred for life. I hope you did enjoy today's video And I did just want to thank you all so much for sticking with me till the end of today's video It really does help me out a ton and you guys are the real G's for that Don't forget to leave a big fat thumbs up subscribe to the channel and ring the bell to turn on all post notifications So you never miss an upload from me and yeah guys, I'll hopefully see you all tomorrow with another video yeah, Peace. Yeah. Oh. He got the life staying on the grind, feeling like Patrick rocking all the time, hitting all the goals, reading all the signs. He'll make it in time, so just leave a like and make it all right. Eating Krabby Patties, making funny lines up at night, making bids for his pastime. Like.